for business before us, I guess, Sonny? Yeah, I handed out the uh, uh, library's trust money. Yes, you did. But it is the library law says they can't be defunded, so the town doesn't even look at the library budget. But they have $125,000 in Vanguard. When I was the trustee, they made me, I, I became the treasurer. I walked in cold. They had a number of CDs. Nobody knew about them. I only found out about them when the renewal letters came. And I put all the money into Vanguard and spread them out into a couple of index funds. That's library money. It's 125000 currently. And it should be. And when I was library trustee, the, the attorney general and the, the assistant attorney general for trust said the libraries should disclose gross budgeting. Un unfortunately, Amanda neglects it. So that's the reason I brought, brought it up. Okay, Sonny, thank you for that. Do they ever use that money for anything, Sonny? <coughs> Mr. Chairman, through you, if I could ask Sonny, do they ever use that money for anything? Um, okay, um, Tim asked a question, Sonny. Did you hear what he said? No. Okay, yeah. ask it again, Tim, please. Do they ever use that Vanguard money for anything? No, not really. So it just sits there? Yeah, but I mean, when they come in, when they want to change the windows, they could have paid, yeah. And that's why I'm bringing it in so those, but they're pretty much out of projects, so they'll find something. Okay. But they've never spent the money on anything, right? No. Okay. And so there's no reason to believe they ever will. Yeah. Okay. Um, Sonny, are you finished with your, yeah. okay. I just want to read something that, um, to make sure that we understand. Um, just a note regarding the continuing issues brought up on the library and the trust accounts that they manage directly. I have attached copies of statutes dealing with the library and have highlighted the important sections dealing with items that are not included in the bu their budgets because they are non-lapsing funds. In other words, not part of their budget. That includes funds from their income generating equipment, which in parentheses is RSA 202 capital A colon 11 hyphen A close parentheses Money received from fines and payments for lost and damaged books shall be held in a non-lapsing separate fund and shall be in addition to the appropriation, and in parentheses, RSA 202-A, semicolon 11, comma, Roman numeral 3, close parentheses. Expend income from all trust funds for library purposes, which is RSA 202-A, semicolon 11, comma, Roman numeral 4. Custody and control of trust funds, RSA 202, hyphen A, colon 22. Library trust fund annual report, RSA 202, hyphen, capital A, colon 12, hyphen A, small a. Annual reports, RSA 202, hyphen A, colon 12. All of these statutes make it very clear that the library trust funds are not part of the annual budget of the library but are non-lapsing funds outside of the budget. Okay, this is from our town manager. He attached all of the examples and highlighted it as well. If anybody would like... Mr. Chairman, I don't know that that question was ever in dispute. I'm just reading. This is in regards to the Yeah, no, they the keep fund. checking I just wanted to. Yeah, I just wanted to, um, because I just received this from the town manager and he wanted to clarify okay so yeah, that's no, I'm just no. reading it for that information only okay thank you very much Sonny anything else about that yeah no what the library trustee uh, what the treasurer does is they they run two checking accounts one for the appropriated funds from the town and the other from the whatever projects raise money so that's really how they keep it separate so okay thank you very much Sonny